Hi, Van here. Thanks for stopping by and checking out my channel. I've got another informative video for you today. This is how to do a monogram. A lot of ladies like the monogram, so first I'm starting out with a 4x4 four four square. If you want to resize your size of your paper, you do it with this icon right up here. Right there. You click on that icon. Right now you see it's set on 4x4. Four four. You can change this if some of them wanted a 6x6 six, six six monogram. Click 6 and hit enter. And uh, let's see, zoom out. Now you've got a 6x6 six six piece of paper that you're going to work with. You need to have your paper size to fit your mat that's in the background because that's what you're going to use to run through your machine. So we're going to go with a 4x4. Four 4.0 four. Four enter. Go down here, backspace. 4.0 enter. And we're going to zoom in one click. We're going to move this on the side to fit it in the screen. Go over here to where you see that on your left side where it's got the A with this with the line beside it, that is your text icon. That is your text icon. So first you want to go text icon, you want to go up here to the top where the A is at there. Click on it. Move this down to where you find a good font. Which one is the one we, we usually use? Uh, Gabriella. Okay, you want to do one letter at a time. And let's see. Let's do uh let's do mine. So my middle initial is E. Let's put our caps on. E. Alright. Then now our next my next one, I want to go over here and click on this letter again. And we can do it off the screen. Is a V. Click off of it. Click back on this. Let's go over here and put a D. Okay. Let's position the E first. Click on the E with your hand and use the little arrow on the side here to resize the E the size that you want. Double click, drag. Don't go by these numbers on the side because those are deceiving. That says it's almost three inches. Well, it is from here to here, but that's not the size of your letter. So move your letter up some, and let's drag it to where the letter is the size that you wanna see. Get your hand back on You gotta have your hand back on it to be able to move it. All right. That, let's see how big it is, actually how big it is. So that's, that's the beginning of the one inch. And it goes down to right here. So that's one, two and a half inches. So if this image is two and a half inches, then you want your, the V and the D to be, so it's two and a half, let's go two inches. And to resize that, you want to go, let's see, right here. We want to fit that D in between that line and that line. Put your hand up there. Okay, the letter's too big. So let's resize the E some. We'll use this right here. This is where you resize your things at. So go to this. It's showing that it's 4.3 inches high. Let's go down to, let's backspace that off and go to, let's say three inches. So if that's at three inches, let's go to this one. It's saying it's 3.1. Let's go to 2.7.
Let's see if we have footage. Yep. All right. 2.7 on this one. Now let's say we're doing this and you say, oh, well, I don't like that font. You're, you click, click off that, bring your hand over, click on that V with the hand, right click, edit text. And you want to double click and hold and swipe. And that highlights this area. And go to your text. There's another good one in the M's. Come on, a little bit farther. Right there, monotype. All right, let's edit that text. If you wanted to just do one letter, let me show you how to do all the letters. Edit, select all. No, that's not right, my bad. So we'll just do one letter here. Right click, edit text. Highlight it. There we go, monotype. Now the D, let's drag the D out of the way. All right, right click, edit text. Double click, hold swipe. Let's go down to the M's. Monotype, okay. Reposition the E. Still not enough room. Let's go to a bigger piece of paper here. Because a four by four on monogram is usually for a 20 ounce, say 20 ounce Yeti. So let's move that out of the way. Click on that, move that out of the way. Let's position the E. Let's drag it down with the arrow. Position in the paper. Click on that one. Position it. Double click and drag. Double click and drag. Okay. Edit. Select all. Alignment, line in the middle. Do you see that? After you get them all in there, you want to go edit, select all. Here's your alignment button right up here. Click on it and then align to middle. Now you want to go to edit. Uh, let's see, it's already all of them selected. Let's see. Edit, select all, go to the bucket. There you go. That's how you do it. It's a monogram. Hey, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, share. Uh, click the notification button. You can see the new videos that I come out with. Uh, I'll be having another one on layering. Layering, that didn't sound right. <laughs> layering layering the image.